boss to the PFL Featherweight Championship. Number one seed, Super Steven Seiler, takes on number two seed, Lance the Party Palmer. What is Seiler's best chance to flip the script and beat Palmer in this rematch? Well, Seiler's the comeback kid, right? Every time when you think the fight is over, he pulls out some magic, it looks like, and then he wins by way of submission, just like he did with his first fight of the season against Idrisov. Idrisov is doing really well. We all thought that actually the fight was going to be over, but Seiler, he kept his eye on the, on, on the referee, and he was giving the thumbs up, saying, hey, I'm okay, so don't worry about it. He slapped on the triangle choke, and he won the fight. Now, in this fight, preferably, he cannot be taken down. It's going to be hard, you know, because he's fighting freaking Lance Palmer. Now, if there's a takedown, it should come from Seiler, and he needs to be on top, because even though Seiler is great on his back, Palmer's submission game is just really good and there are way more options if you are on top. You also can use ground and pound. Now, if I would be Siler, I would try to stand with Palmer. Just play the striking game and when he sees an opening, then try to go for a takedown. Palmer wore out his opponents this season with his wrestling. What makes him so hard to control and can he use that same strategy against Siler this time around? Oh, yes, he can because his wrestling is so dominating. He's, he can pretty much do anything. There's not a person, not a fighter that he cannot take down. Now, Palmer needs to do simply what he always does. Strike with his opponent, wait for the perfect moment, and then go from the, uh, for the take down. From there, work ground and pound, and of course, go for submission. Now, if he feels that Siler is constantly attacking him on the ground, he should do the same thing. So not only defending, he needs to start attacking as well, because if we have judges like they have in Japan, you know, the person who works the most on the ground, even when he's on his back, is going to be awarded with a victory. So he cannot take that risk being on top and riding it out because if a silo is constantly attacking him, he needs to start working, not only defending again, not only defending, but immediately start attacking as well.